What is up you guys? It is Bethany Hiddle here. This is the third video that I'm doing today. Also, in this video, I'm going to show you guys some of my well, eh, some of my favorite uh it's like one of my favorite bands. So, if you know me, I love music. I, not only do I love music, but to me, music is life. So, yeah, today is brought to you by me. No, um, I'm going to show you guys a band, or some CDs that I have, well, CDs that I have of this band. That I've been listening to for a while now. <sighs> I've liked them when I was younger. Uh, yeah. So. Here we go. So starting off with CDs. The first one that they ever released. Was. Wide Open Spaces. Turn that off. Okay, the first one they ever released was Wide Open Spaces. Alright. So, over 11 million sold, Hit Savers Platinum. No clue what that is. But, yeah. Just got it. It's amazing. It's kind of hard to see the disc. But, yeah. Love it. You know, songs I like on here are I Can Love You Better, Wide Open Spaces, There's a Trouble, You Are Mine, and, oh, am I the only one that's ever felt this way? That was Wide Open Spaces. Alright, this next one is Fly. This one is my favorite album, because... I know majority of the songs on here, and they're awesome. I mean, yeah. Let me see here. This is what the disc looks like. I wonder if we can just do that. Yeah, that's better. Okay. Alright, songs on here that I like include Ready to Run, If I Fall, You're Going Down With Me, Cowboy Take Me Away, Cold Day in July, Goodbye Earl, Hello, Hello Mr. Heartache, Sin Wagon, Without You, Some Days You Gotta Dance, Some Days You Gotta Dance. That's the second one they released. The third one that they released is Home. Yeah, Home. Uh... This one I've got to be careful with because, uh, yeah, the disc looks like, I have to put it back together now. Okay, songs on here that I like include... Literally all of them. I mean, literally. There's only 11 songs. Or 12 songs, I'm sorry. Long time gone. But anyway, I'm going to go through. You can count as many as you want. But I'm just going to tell you literally all of them. Okay, not all of them. I just found a couple that I don't know. But songs on here that I do know and like include... Long time gone, Landslide. Their cover of Landslide is awesome. Uh, Traveling Soldier, Tooth Number Two, White Trash Wedding, A Home, Tortured Tangled Hearts, Little Jack Slade, Godspeed Sweet Dreams, and Top of the World. That's the third one that they released. This next one is the fourth one that they released, and I honestly 
I've had this in a while. This one was one my dad played a lot when I was growing up. Like, he'd come home, well, he'd pick me up from Grandma and Grandpa's house. I'd go get in his truck and fall asleep, and as soon as he got off work, he'd had the CD playing. But it's, uh, yeah, the Dixie Chicks Live, Todd the World Tour. This is a two-disc uh, CD, so I'm not going to take them out, but there's disc one, and forgot disc number two comes out, and there's disc number two. Okay, how do I do this? Okay, got it. But yeah, bought this one on eBay like last year, and so yeah. All right, their fifth album release was after tragedy. Well, it ain't tragedy, but it's whatever. 2003, Natalie Maines, the lead singer, said something about the president that they were, she was ashamed that he was from Texas. And then they came out with an album after, three years after that, called Taking, Damn it. called Taking the Long Way. Yeah, called Taking the Long Way. Oh, I forgot to do... I literally know and like all of them on here. But anyway, Taking the Long Way was one that I guess she did, like apologizing or something. I don't know. But songs on here that I like include The Long Way Around, Not Ready to Make Nice, Everybody Knows, Love it or leave it. Yeah. That's it. But, yeah. Alright. Um. Their seventh album that they made. So, okay. I've got five. Okay, that I just did. Their seventh album. I don't have their sixth. But their sixth album is DC X. Well, it's DCX. Six. But that's a live album. When I find that, I will get it. But this new one that they released, was, they released it uh, last year. And it is called Gaslighter. That's their newest one. I'll be honest, this is the first artist that has released the album and I got it within a year of it being released. Def Leppard released a uh, volume box volume 3 a uh, collector's box what two years ago? It was a year ago. Haven't got it yet. But yeah. <clears throat> yeah. So, Gaslighter, songs that I like on here is, okay, I thought I said that wrong, okay. Songs that on here that I like are Gaslighter, Sleep at Night, Texas Man, Everybody Loves You, March March, um, Joanna, Calm Down, that's the only ones that I really know, I'm gonna have to listen to it more, to, yeah. Now, that's the CDs. Let's move on to movies. I only have one movie. Top of World Tour Live. But yeah, I mean. But yeah. It looks just like the CD. But yeah, this is uh, Clips. Well, this is their... When they did that concert in 
So basically they show clips of them singing different songs that's on the album from each city that they went to, except Louisville, Kentucky. But in 2003, when they did that album, they came to Louisville, Kentucky. They came to Freedom Hall. And the reason I know this is because... Where's that? It's a, Why do you not be able to find it? Oh, right there. Welcome to Freedom Hall. That's in Louisville, Kentucky, yo. That is literally where State Fair is. Every year. So, yeah. Alrighty. Put that back in there. But yeah, and that was, yeah, right there. So yeah, that concludes all of the Dixie Chicks slash the Chicks. CD slash DVD that I have. So yeah. I am working on getting more DVDs, and I am definitely working on getting that, their sixth album. Even though it's just alive, I really like the band, so, yeah. But, alright, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and see you guys later. Bye, guys.